So you've turned off the paved road and gone through the cattle gate. It's time to enter the spooky trailer. <laughs> Greetings, Halloween fans. It's me, your one free boy, Ravan. And you're watching The Never Show. Yes, the only show with haunted lemon-scented limes. And the only show with a free, supernatural, super awesome third eye and planted right into your head. <laughs> and yes, before we get started, I must thank you for clicking that subscribe button and that little bell icon and the like button. It's better than I deserve and more than I'd ever thought I'd get. Thank you. <laughs> and without further digression, Bring forth today's harrowing movie offering! <laughs> And today's Halloween movie offering is Halloween. Happy Halloween! <laughs> it's a rated off film. It is an hour and 46 minutes. And Kitty did an ADD at all. <laughs> it's a great horror thriller. Uh, director of Scaramonies was Gordon Green. He also did some of the writing on this. Along with Danny McBride, Jeff Farley, based on the characters of John Carpenter and Deborah Hill. <laughs> Our cast, first build only because you don't want to listen to me slaughter names all day, was Jamie Lee Curtis as Laura Strode. Now, Jamie's gun control, not uh, NRA thing, it did make an, uh, a kind of awkward wrinkle in the movie but i understand that she has different views than i do and i can really understand but it i had to look into it more before i understand it her point of view and i do now and it did bias me a little bit going into the movie not knowing the full story and everything uh judy judy greer as karen andy muck matt trick as allison james jude Courtney as the shape, Nick Castle as the shape, Haku Binger as Dr. Star Sarton, Will Patterson as Officer Hawkins, Rihanna Reeves as Dana Harris, Jeff Hall as Aaron Kerroy, Toby Huss as Ray, Virginia Gardner as Vicky, Dylan Arnold as Cameron Elam, Miles Robinson as Dave, uh, Drew Schred as Oscar, and Jabral Na. Not taboom. If I'm pronouncing it wrong, I don't know. <laughs> As Julian, and this kid was so cute. He had so many one-liners in this movie, and it was he was hilariously cute. I loved him. He really did make the movie, and that's our cast first build only. Because you know why? <laughs> oh, let's get down to our production companies. Where Blumhouse Productions, Miramax, Roughhouse Pictures, Transcendental Films, Universal Pictures, and our distributor here in the good old United States of America. God bless America! Land that I love was Universal Pictures. Uh, no special effects companies are listed. I checked everywhere and I cannot find them. They were not in any of the, the packets I was given for this movie. I wish I could say this thing this these are my favorite new uh special effects warehouses but i can't because they didn't list them i don't know why and with that said let's get on to my personal thoughts about this movie oh my god he got sh 
<laughs> yeah. Uh, if you're looking for a high kill count Michael Myers movie with less subtle kills, this is the movie for you. And I can understand Michael Myers is getting old. 1963 has been a long time. He's done a good load of killing, and his body count is quite impressive. And it just was one of those things that I like that they did progress quickly. And once they got going, it was a scream ride all the way to the end for, I just wish that they had padded it out a little more for an hour and 46 minutes. Couldn't we've gone to just two hours? I mean, you're, you know, an extra, you know, 10 minutes here to give Michael a little more subtlety in his murder. Murdering spree would have been way more interesting. And I feel like his part was very fast paced. Don't know if this is the end of the Halloween series. To be honest with you, it feels like this is finality, but you never know with horror movie monsters. They always seem to come back. That bad penny and black cat saw us. <laughs> we'll come back again and again. But if this is where it ends, I feel that this is a good place to end it. But I don't want to spoil it for you. You are going to have to watch the movie. It is a 7.5 IMDb out of 10. It is a 79% on a Rotten Tomatoes. I mean, what more? It's certified fresh. This is the horror movie that you've been waiting for. This is the horror movie that you want. I do want to see what CinemaSins thinks. Because you know me, I get dazed and dazzled by the decadence of too many horror movies. <laughs> and I do always like to have someone check my, check my six, if you know what I mean. If you like what you've seen here, make sure you smash that like button in the face. It means absolutely nothing in the YouTube algorithm. But hey, if you feel like doing it, do it. Because bigger kitty heads can be made for... The monsters behind the mask. <laughs> Remember, all comments are 100% guaranteed response. Tell me your realities, your fan fictions, your tales of Anwi, your tales of yay. Scream if you want to, because I want to hear it from you. Your comments are the highlight of my day. You know I have to ask. We've got an Amazon. We have a Patreon. And yes, we fixed but My Patreon was not correct. Thank you. You don't realize how little I have to do so much. It's not without your donations that this channel keeps going. I wish I could put your names in, and now I can because now we have everything fixed. And if you want to see more of this murder and mayhem of Halloween, make sure you hit that subscribe button and that little bell icon. And I'll see you all in the next Halloween movie review. Bye! <laughs> Ha <laughs> 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 Thank you.